Hi everybody, it's Linda. And um, I'm going to put my two cents worth on, on Duck Dynasty, which I really thought the show was about ducks because we don't watch TV. And um, I think that's what everybody should do now that I see where this is going. Um, I see a lot of inaction. We don't spend a lot of time on the internet. We don't watch TV. I used to spend a lot of time on the internet and then I had to get away from it too because it sucks you in like the TV and I don't need to be programmed. The one thing I need to do is be unprogrammed. First of all, if someone's gay, that's their business. Um, if Christians have a problem with it, let Christians do what they do. Quit preaching to the rest of the world. I'm not a Christian. I think that Christians ought to it will never unite. What the hell is going on? We're never going to unite. You know, bestiality is in the NDAA, and nobody, no Christians has said anything about that. I guarantee you the first soldier or person that walks up and wants to pardon my language, fuck my goat, Bob, I'm going to shove something up their mouth and shoot them. You know, no one's up in arms over that, but what two people do in their bedroom, they're having a say-so, this country was not founded on Christian principles. It was taken from original peoples who did not believe in the Christian way. You guys can thumb this down all you want. I'm sick of this. Most of you seem to watch TV. Yes, this is my rant. This is the first time you'll ever see me angry. I'm usually very kind and patient, but I'm losing my patience. I thought that this YouTube would unite us, but it's dividing us. I don't care if you're a Christian. I, I, most of my friends are Christians, and they wouldn't dare say anything about this stuff around me. And most of my Christian friends don't watch TV. So this would mean nothing to them because it's a personal belief to them. And we've set all our differences aside, but the rest of, there's, there's no humanity left. No one can set a difference aside. If, if you're in a battle against the government and a gay guy picks up a gun and stands next to you and guards you, are you going to say, well, you can't be around me because I'm a Christian and you're gay? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? And I hope every show goes off the TV and maybe you people will get unbrainwashed. I mean, we have not had a TV in our house in I can't even tell you how many years. When we invite YouTubers here, and when they come in, they all know they have to take their batteries out of their cell phones. Kenny has a cell phone for when he's on the road. That's it. We don't use a cell phone in this house. We just don't. The computer, this is our only access to civilized world, unless you come visit us, or a home landline. But, but the rest of it's got to go. You've got to get back to the basics. Joy was here this summer. We planted a garden. You know what we used to do? We hung out all day outside, grazed in the garden. Usually we didn't even have to come in and cook because everybody had eaten stuff out of the garden raw. Corn, heirloom corn, all kind of stuff. We had people come visit us all summer long. It was awesome. We got to know one another face to face. We didn't watch TV. We talked. We put aside all differences. And all I see is divide and conquer. It's just happening over and over and over again. If religion is controlling your life that much, and, and I would think that if I was a Christian, if I was a Christian, <clears throat> being brainwashed by the TV would be a taboo, a no-no. So Christians watch TV, and they watch something called Duck Dynasty, which I did. I thought it was about ducks. <laughs> that tells you I don't watch TV. The only one thing I have noticed is if somebody puts up something from one of the cable news things, and sometimes I watch it, those people don't age. I swear they don't age. It's like they've had stuff pre-programmed or their droids or something because they never, ever age. It's bizarre to me. But we don't even go in the house. Most of our friends, if we go to their house, they turn their TV off. And now I've even got some of my family, like my niece, not watching TV. I had to call her once and say, what's dancing with the stars? I thought people were dancing out in front of the stars because everybody was talking about that. I don't know about um, these movie stars like, um, the, the. I guess it begins with a K, Cardiasm or something. Um, people keep bringing that up. I don't know who the hell it is because I don't give them my energy. And that's what we all ought to do. We ought to unite instead of being divided. The TV's dividing people, for God's sakes. Look at what's happening. 
All I'm seeing is videos over Duck Dynasty and I really thought it was about ducks, not religious and gays. I'm telling you, bestiality is a bigger problem. Why aren't Christians screaming about that? I have a farm. Nobody better come here and try to screw one of my animals. They're dead. I'm telling you now, they're dead. And I don't believe in child molestation or pedophilia. But if two grown adults want to do something in their bedroom, who am I to say anything? The only thing I would say to gays is, why did you let the government get involved? I mean, you had it better when the government wasn't involved. Now, if you want to marry, you got to buy a license. And then for married people, why don't you just get married by somebody who doesn't do it on something? Because a license to get married is absurd. I, I just, I don't understand. People say one thing and they do another thing. And I had to rant about this because it's kind of pissed me off. Um, especially when I don't know what you people are talking about. And if it's a reality show, let me tell you, a reality show is the same as a regular program. They retake and they retake and they have certain things they have to do. It's just like I was, I hung out with musicians and I'm a musician. And, and it's the same thing. Even though you do a live show, it's, you have rehearsals, you have everything. So it's not that reality. Take it from me, it's not. Now, I, all I got to say, if anything's produced in Hollywood or by Hollywood, get away from it. And for goodness sakes, don't let a reality not reality show tell you how to believe. Start thinking for yourself and get unprogrammed. I love all you guys, but every food YouTube video I've seen lately is on this. And like I said, I thought it was about ducks. And I thought, well, I know about ducks because we raise ducks. But obviously I don't because this is about Christianity and gays. And I've had just about enough of the divide and conquer. And I'm a Native American. There's gay Native Americans. They're called two-spirit people. Nobody makes a big deal out of them in the Native American community. And if nobody would have ever made a big deal about gay people, this would have never, ever, ever been brought to attention. Some politician did it in the 20th century and now look at it. And gay people would have just been left alone to do their own thing. Nobody would have thought any different about them. It's been going on since time has begun. If somebody thinks different, go read some real history. Gay people have been around. And they have been soldiers. They've been all kind of things. So let's get over this. In Christianity, Christians, if you're not outraged over bestiality, then stop being outraged over gay people. And... If you want to unsub me at this point, unsub me because you're programmed if you're watching TV. Anyway, first thing everybody needs to do for their Christmas, which we don't celebrate. Today's the winter solstice. I think everybody should celebrate it. It's the longest night. But go out Christmas Day, do yourself a favor, and shoot the damn TV. And you'll have withdrawals, and then after that, you'll start thinking clearly. But... That's my rant for today, but this is getting ridiculous. You're letting a TV program, you know, it programs the mind, tell you how to feel and think. You know that everything is personal to everybody. I mean, free speech is one thing, and what someone does in their bedroom is another thing, and it's nobody else's business. And if A and D and E cancel them, so what? It's a program, mind control program. Peace. Love, truth, sorry about the rant, but I can't even follow you guys on YouTube right now until you get over this stuff. Let's unite and stop the division. Set differences aside. Listen, one thing we can agree on. This is our home, the planet Earth, and we need to start taking care of her. Can we all agree on that one thing? If you can, thumb it up. Peace.